The PT Demo, a game that absolutely shook the horror community. So many people wanted more. So many people made their own interpretations. And now we are here with Cycle. Hey everyone and welcome to a new adventure in Cycle. This is by 616 Games and it is their take on the PT Demo. I'm interested to see how this plays because I don't really think of 616 when I think of something like the PT Demo. I know they make a lot of comedy or parody style horror games and I, I don't know what they're going to do with this. So let's get into it. Let me know if you saw or played the PT Demo down in the comments what you think about it. I would love to hear your thoughts. Like I said, it was really big in the horror community. So I'm excited for this. Whoa, hello. Are there flies around me? Do I stink? Yeah, okay, I can see why there's flies around me. Is that blood? I normally don't wake up with blood at my feet. That's... That's not an everyday... In case you were wondering, because I, I, could, I could see why you would think that would be the case, but I don't typically wake up with the blood around me. Oh, this is a weird chair. Oh, yeah. That's top 10 weird chairs. What's up, gamers? The last thing you want in your weird apartment is a, a chair with blood on it. But today we're counting down top 10 weirdest chair. Oh, I'm sorry. This is somewhat mm, off, you know? I haven't, I don't think I've played a, a PT demo in like the PS1 style graphics. It's an interesting take on it. It's a nice radio. Lovely. You know? What could go wrong? What could go wrong? When you got a vase this good, you know you're in a good setting, you know? Nobody has a vase this good if they're gonna murder you. I love to look at artwork in these games. I don't know why. I just love to... Okay, never mind. What is that? Hello? Who are you? Okay. Do you have a face? Uh-huh. Banana. Married people. Water bottle. Okay, I'm just listing off objects again. Hey, 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 hey. Well, is that the, uh, the, 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 the Boy Scouts? Are they selling... I was in the Boy Scouts. We don't go door to door. <laughs> Silly me. Is that, uh, is there somebody, is there somebody out there? <laughs> it's locked. Wait, is it locked? Why is it locked? What? I know that there's supposed to be a loop. Is that medicine? For some reason, it look like, this doesn't look like a door. I know it says door, and your mind might be telling you that it's a door. I don't think it's a door. What do you, I, I don't know. I just get the feeling that it's not a door. Mm, you know? This feels like a door. I don't know why. I, I can't put my finger on it. Alright. Wait. Uh, huh? Hello? I can't go back. Somebody's banging on stuff, but like outside. That sounds like outside's problem, not my problem. I mean, it's a nice calm night, you know? Not even any bad weather. Okay, no, I definitely hear a banging. Why? Okay, th these are different people. Which is obvious, but like, I don't feel like it's like one family. I feel like these are just random people. You can do that. I just re- Who the- Hey! <laughs> Who was that? Was that the IRS? Door. Still can't open it. Is there blood on that? Ooh, that's gonna be rough. Ooh, that was on sale at Ikea. We're not gonna be able to replace that. That was last year's mount. <sighs> I'm not gonna be able to play it. And like, it matches this rug. So like, what am I gonna do? I have to get two new rugs? Huh? Cause, cause one's got blood on it? Gosh. I'm gonna have to get two new rugs. What do I look like? Two rugs? Ah! <laughs> Sorry, um, listen. That was all scary and well and good and all that, but I'm having a crisis over here. I have to buy two new rugs. Like, a little sympathy, please? Like, give me a second. Like, come on. Is it because I insulted the door? What are you, the door police? Ooh, ooh. Okay, you're gone. <laughs> you're not going to scare me with teleportation, all right? You're not going to get me again, David Blaine. Is that more blood? Is it my blood? I think I would be seeing things, too, if I lost that much blood, okay? Sometimes I lose a lot of blood and I see the hat man. He's in the corner. He's watching me. He says, Mark, you should get a blood transfusion. You've lost a lot of blood. I say, hat man, I don't know what that is. Silly little hat man. Do your little dance in the corner and, and make me laugh. Are there bugs on my wall? Ooh. Ew, you're gross. I hate bugs. 
Wow. Okay. Maybe somebody likes bugs. It's not my fault. Ooh, chandelier swinging. Ooh, that's not going to be good. Oh. Do you think it'll fall on me? Oh. Oh, it's, it's lit up now. Door. Woo. Oh, no. Baby room. Ugh. Scary. Note. Q. Examine. Read. I, Dr. Mark Peckle. I try very hard to read, okay? I, Mark Peckle, declare the patient John Rubick be able to resume their normal life following a treatment and weekly follow-up. Oh, wait, is that us? Are we John? The patient was diagnosed. I try very hard to read, okay? The patient was diagnosed two years ago with dual personality. One of them being aggressive and violent. After treatment with Thorazine and Sat... Oh, are those the bottles that were in the, the, the foyer? The foyer. You see, I know big words. The patient showed improvement in his self-control. Therefore, I declare the patient mentioned above is able to return to his home. Look at me. I can return to my home. I thought there was going to be something behind me. <laughs> Why would there be? Oh, God, hang on. I just, I had an, an I was, I wasn't scared. I, I, uh, I inhaled really quickly. Um, I suddenly remembered I had to breathe, so I did that really fast, and I made a funny little noise. All right, I wasn't scared. Mm, somebody's crying. Is that my medication? Did I forget to take it? Okay, so um, carrying the two, that that's a shadow of a person. You know, that's a person shadow. Hello, what are you gonna do? You can't hurt me! You can't hurt me! Nope! Nope, going back to the room. Hey! Uh-uh. Uh-uh-uh-uh. Uh-uh-uh-uh. No, no, no. Don't go out. Just stay on. Please. Stay on. I'm hiding in a corner. I'm literally hiding. Oh. I got my own. Oh. Oh. Fire solves everything. Fire solves everything. If you charge at me, I will burn down this house. You don't know what I'm capable of. Okay, I'm capable of arson, that's for sure. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. I hate when things run at me. I don't know how to process emotions right now. I'm just doing 180s or 360s, whatever. Door. Hi. Okay. Just a nightmare of fire. I knew it couldn't hurt me because it was just a nightmare. That's blood though, and that's a okay. Um, that's not, that's not good. Um, I don't think we were well enough to return to our home. I think I need more help. I think I need more professional help. But I hear happy radio this time. Oh, 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 that's a lot of medication. What does it say? I'm so happy today. I took the pregnancy test and finally got pregnant. After many years of treatment, John and me will finally have a baby. I haven't told him yet. I want to surprise him. I'm afraid of his reaction. He's making progress in his treatment, but still has some flare-ups. Mia. Oh, that's sad, but happy. You know, hopeful. You know, there's hope. Hopefully, uh, keeping up with our treatments. Oh no. Well, that's not good. Haha, <laughs> I know a bad sign when I see one. Blood is definitely one. All right, well, I can't go that way, so I'm gonna ignore that red flag. There's something in here now? No? Hello? It's unfortunate. What? What's unfortunate? About your wife. About my wife? Today, I've heard terrible news. A man had a psychotic break. His wife to death. What? He took the fetus out of her belly. In the crib. Did I murder my wife? Months pregnant. The man suffered from split personality. Why is that voice getting louder from the in my head? The hospital a few months ago. What? That was me? I did that? Wait, tell me there's not something in here. <sighs> now I'm more sad than scared. Now I'm just really sad. Oh man, this is like horrible all around. Like, why am I 
footsteps more thumping, more ominous. Everything's just a little bit more ominous. Are the bugs still ugh, they're still around? Stop it! Stop it! Listen, I know everything's messed up and bad, and I did bad, and it's this is a horrible situation. But please stop! Please stop! Oh, this is a weird loop because I keep having to go back. And Hello? What? Room opened. Don't tell. Oh no, it's the bug room. I don't think I've been in this room before, have I? Hello? What? Hi? Bugs? Can I get in? Can I squeeze in? <laughs> I could have predicted that. I should have predicted that. Oh, it's, it's okay. It's okay. It's, everything's okay. I'm gonna go back to my chair. I'm gonna go back to my chair. Who's crying? The sound sounds so. F Hello? What's happening? Is that my baby? Hi! Whoa! Oh, oh, I don't like this. I don't like these sounds. I don't like this at all. Why do I keep waking up here? Everything seems normal. Seems is the key word. What door is gonna open for me now? What? Hello? Who's stepping? I hate this. I hate this. I feel like the sounds are coming from be behind me and in front of me at the same time. Hello? Don't do anything weird. Please. Oh, I don't like this. Are they at my front door? Hello? No, it's locked. Everything's still locked. Great. Okay, good. Don't laugh at me. I'm not that funny. Locked. This is thumping. Why is there thumping? Oh, bathroom. Bathroom? No, this is not a good room. I remember now what happened in this room. I think, right? I mean, there's bugs. That's gross. That's really gross. Oh, is that a... What is that? A note. Okay. It's been two months since John got out of the hospital. We're very happy with Alice's arrival. I'm worried because sometimes he has outbreaks. Whenever this happens, I lock myself in the bathroom. Oh no. Oh no. Oh my. I can't believe he's still not like getting help. Like back in the hospital. Hello? Hello? Hello, I hear a phone ringing. Aha! Hello? Hello? Anyone there? Yep, wrong number. Yep. Okay. Okay. Oh no! Hello? Okay, well, I just randomly started the loop again. I have no idea how I did that. I have literally no idea. I was just walking around aimlessly. I don't, I don't like these sounds. I don't like these sounds at all. Oh no. Oh, is that? What is the baby's face doing in the, the floorboards? What is the baby's face in this? What the? What is the baby doing? What is the, what is the baby doing? Hi baby. Oh. Okay. Oh, it's a baby's face. Hey, honey. Oh. Okay, so now this is definitely uh, it, like a, a non-normal amount of blood. That's a literal lake. Oh, gosh. Yeah, I get the feeling that stuff's gone horribly wrong with our family. I get the feeling. I get the feeling. Okay, uh, open the door. Yup. I can't leave. I can't leave. Great. Good. 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 I like the blood room. Uh, it's nice. Oh, good. Okay, I can leave now. Hello? Hello? Oh, no. The the, the walls are dripping blood. This is... This is a, this is a, this is a red flag. I, I, got, I get the feeling that something bad is going to happen. Yeah, something bad is going to happen. I'm moving slow. I'm moving real slow. Hello? Something in front of me? What is that? What is that noise? Okay, can I leave? Okay, I get the feeling that, you know, we've got some guilt and some trauma going on. 
a lot to process. But I have no idea what's happening right now. The baby room. Hello? The baby. Oh no. Oh my goodness. Is that our baby? Wait, what? Why did this close? I can't get out. I can't get out. Hello? Q. Oh, this is the, the same doctor's note. Ah! I'm gonna die. 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 <laughs> okay. Oh, good. It was just another loop. I'm so sick of these loops. Okay. Well, the bugs are still here. <laughs> Lovely familiarities, you know? Lovely familiarities. Oh. Okay, well this room looks uh not as weird. Crib's empty. Alright. Little unexpected actually. Oh man. Does anyone get the other the sense of impending dread as you round every corner? Okay. Oh okay. The bathroom. Needs a bit of a touch up. Needs a bit of a touch up. Hey! Oh hello! What's the matter? Well, I know what the matter is. I'm so. <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> okay, yeah, that's fair. That's that's fair. Um. Oh my goodness. Well, I think that's uh, the end of the cycle. I guess we. Did, but also, I have no idea of like what's reality. So. Oh, what? Hello. What's happening? Oh no! Oh my gosh! Oh my goodness! Yeah, no, no. That is so disturbing. It's unfortunate, the world we live in. People who don't value life. Today I bring terrible news. A man had a psychotic break and stabbed his wife to death. He took the fetus out of her belly and put it in the crib. She was three months pregnant. The man suffered from oh. split personality and had been released from the psychiatric hospital a few months ago. How Dude. bad can human be? Oh my god. Maybe I don't remember the PT demo being so much, but oh my goodness. Yeah, that was a lot. Gosh, I was messed up. Yeah, I don't remember thinking about it too too much, but why why did John get released? He still needed help, you know? Like, it's a whole messed up situation. But like, at the root of it, why why was he released from the hospital? But let me know what you think. What do you think of this game? The uh the whole PT as a as a genre at this point, I feel like a lot of different games have used this whole looping feeling. Like there's been so many games inspired by PT that, that it is pretty much like a genre at this point. I don't know if we'll ever get a full PT experience about the game, but all of these fan games, especially this one, were fantastic. I feel like they fit the theme perfectly. Either way, I don't really have any clever things to say for this outro about our channel members, so just Thank you for supporting the channel and supporting me. It means a lot to me. Thank you. Either way, thank you all for joining today's adventure and cycle. As always, hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more. And of course, hope you have a great rest of your day. Remember, with courage and determination, any adventure is possible. And I'll see you on our next one. Bye-bye.